Michael Bublé has been entertaining audiences for more than a decade and has sold more than 75 million records worldwide, winning numerous awards, including four Grammys. The 46-year-old tied the knot with his wife Luisa Nalopi Lotto, 35, and the couple share four children, Noah, 9, Elias, 6, Vida, 4, and Cello, who they welcomed last month. The Just Haven't Met You Yet hitmaker has admitted he plans to spend more time with his young family, as the singer said has not loving his career as much. Michael spoke candidly in a new interview, where he opened up about his plans for the future, and it seemed music may soon take a back seat. Addressing his career on that Gabby Roslin podcast, he said, I think him not loving it as much, I think him getting close to thinking maybe I can just go and be a dad. I have this picture in my head, of just me in a field with my kids and Ed Sheeran's kids and we're just hugging each other and picnicking and getting drunk. Michael admitted he often has to remind himself how lucky he is if he isn't feeling his work as he prepares to head on his world tour this month. He went on to share that although part of him does want to focus on being a full-time father, he described it as a fantasy and said few people are brave enough to do it. Michael said, I don't know a friend that doesn't have the same thought, I mean we never do it, we never seem to really do it, very few of us are brave enough to say, no, I just want to do this, but I think it's a fantasy. The performer also addressed his work-life balance adding it is difficult to manage both successfully. He explained having a family has put the brakes on him being solely focused on music. Michael commented, you can't do both successfully. Relatively, you can have success, but I think one always suffers. It's funny, if you talk to my manager, he's a beautiful guy but he's managed a lot of big careers, he'd say flat out, if Bublé didn't get married and have those kids he'd be a bigger star, easily, truthfully, continued the star. The musician admitted it sucks having to choose between a successful career or family life. Carol Vorderman slips up that she was on heat during holiday latest Heidi Klum. 49, flaunts figure in bikini as she strips off in desert pictures Emily Maitlis proposed to her husband, and he said no admission, my manager always says to me, it isn't tough to make the decisions kid, it's tough to live with the consequences of those decisions, so can you live with the consequences of that Mike? If you put your family first it's going to hurt our career in those countries, what do you think? Recalled the singer. Michael met his wife in 2008 when they were introduced following a concert in Buenos Aires. They were engaged two years later in 2010 and then married in 2011. The popular crooner released his 11th studio album earlier this year and it shot straight to number one on the UK official chart. However, in Italy, it peaked at 43, as well as 11 on the Dutch album Top 100, with Michael putting the dip down to his a lack of press trips to the countries. The singer has had his plate full after his other half recently gave birth to their daughter. His partner, Louis Sonoff, shared a heartwarming snap with their newborn as they prepared to take their daughter home, a baby girl named Cello Yoli Rose. Michael was there to support his wife's step of the way, with one picture showing him holding her in the labor room, 